Today I'm working on this 996 Porsche, it's a 02. And um, just making a quick video talking about something I see pretty often on these. It's, um, if you're wondering what all this foam is blowing out of your vents, you'll see it on Volkswagens and Audis and BMWs and uh, every other car that I work on anyways. I see it very often on cars early 2000s, all the way to, you know, the 90s, you know, even in the 80s, kind of the same kind of concept. They used foam around the climate control um, flaps. So the, the flaps inside your dashboard that make your defrost work and, and shut off the air going to the center vent. And then you can see this stuff blowing out as I'm talking here. And then the, the flaps that, you know, that move the air around as well as control the temperature. The um, blend door that controls the temperature also has a, a foam, a foam, um, it's coated in foam and that's what seals up against the, uh, against the box itself to uh, divert the air. So, um, some, it's usually pretty harmless. You'll you'll start to notice a, a little bit of a reduction in performance with your your heat and AC a lot of times when your blend door starts falling apart because it can't regulate the temperature quite as well. At the maximum, you know, if you have full heat on or full AC on, there may be some some of the heat may be leaking through when you have it shut in such a way where it's supposed to be only AC and uh, vice versa. And you may notice that when you t turn on your um, your 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 vents and you change you go to hit your defrost you may get some air coming out of these vents and that's just because all that foam that's blowing out everywhere is, is no longer sealing the uh the flaps so pretty common the fix is not easy you'd have to pull everything apart and replace your your whole climate control assembly or you'd have to uh, replace the doors sometimes the doors are um, you can replace them individually depending on the car but uh yeah that's it so if you're seeing that, that's what it is. You can just clean it out the best you can and deal with it. It's usually what most people choose to do. Or if you're feeling like uh, getting involved in a, a pretty big repair, pull it all apart and change out your doors. So thanks for watching.